how to drop ship from Amazon to TikTok shop. Hello guys and welcome back to today's video. In today's video, we will be tackling on how you will be able to do a drop shipping business model between Amazon and TikTok shop, wherein we will be getting our products from Amazon that we will be selling into our TikTok shop. Now, there are multiple ways for us to tackle this. There is a method through TikTok. There's a method through a third-party app like Shopify. And there's a manual method where we will be able to take products from Amazon to TikTok shop manually. Now, the last step that I mentioned or the last method that I mentioned is a bit uh, not practical. It's a bit uh, time-consuming. But if you fail to connect or if you are a unable to connect, the platforms that we will be discussing later on or if you don't want to use those type of apps or if it's not available in your area the last method will still be able to be successful or you will still be able to utilize it and still be able to perform a drop shipping interaction so first things first let's explain how drop shipping works so we have a um, simple visualization over here so the way drop shipping works is that someone will order through your store so this is our store over here and what we would do is we would like to sell to our viewers or our customers which is our customers over here so the way normally things goes is that you're selling to our customer and when someone orders to us we will send them the product but in drop shipping we will not have the inventory we will, we ourselves do not handle the product so I, it's like I'm going to be selling products that I don't own, but I'm still going to earn money through some additional payments. Like I will be able to get a certain percentage of that product or it depends on how I set things up. And the way dropshipping works is we're going to be finding a partner or like a source of product. In our case, we have Amazon over here, which will be our source of product or source of warehouse. And we will just be a front. And our front would be TikTok shop seller, which is a really great platform nowadays because TikTok in itself has a lot of users. It, you can generate a lot of traffic, a lot of views on your store, and there's a high chance for you to be able to sell a lot of things. You are able to use TikTok's different features like live or TikTok shop itself to sell your different products. And we will be able to use Amazon's products for those. And then when someone orders, what happens? We don't have the product. When someone orders, the order would be redirected to Amazon or the shop of Amazon itself or whoever is selling from Amazon. And they will be the one who will send it to your customers and not us anymore. No longer us. So over here, let's show you the TikTok method. So now in TikTok over here, there are apps and services that we will be able to use. So over here on the left side, over here, we have this feature apps and services. So simply select this and click on app store. Over here, we will be able to see the different apps that we will be able to connect and integrate with our TikTok shop. So over here, as you can see, most of these are companies or apps that are based in the same location as TikTok or partners with TikTok. And over here, we will be able to manage and like filter out the different apps that we could use. So there are different apps such as for e-commerce management, merchandising, shipping and fulfillment, customer service, and many more. And you could see here that there are different or there's a list of different popular platforms over here. So we have our typical Shopify, Lazada, Shopee. AliExpress, Amazon, eBay, WooCommerce, Etsy, Wish, Adobe, BigCommerce, Tokopedia, Tiki, and many, many more. And our goal here is the establishment of a connection between Amazon. So if we select Amazon over here, it will show us all the different apps. In total, right now, we have nine. These are apps that have or is able to establish a connection between Amazon Store and your TikTok shop. So we have Eprolo, we have XWX ERP, uh, Linkxing over here, ERP, most of them are ERP as you can see. So we could check them out over here as you can see. Uh, what you will be able to do with these apps is that you will be able to manage order fulfillment, product sourcing, print on demand, customer service, 
and the different integrated platforms are as you can see at Express, Amazon, eBay, Etsy, WooCommerce, Shopify, and Wish over here. So you will be able to use all of these key features over here, which will allow you to perform or establish a dropshipping connection between Amazon. Now, you could use any of the apps that you have over here. I can't really show you guys the app itself and like how it works because I don't have a store in Amazon. So that's one of the first thing that you need to set up as well because to start selling in Amazon, there's a lot of steps, there's a lot of confirmation. So before anything else, before you try using Amazon as a source of product, uh, you could also need to, you might also need to set up your store in Amazon, but you will be able to use this as well. Now, the TikTok options or like the TikTok apps over here are a bit restricting in my opinion. Uh, there's uh, a lot of things that you won't be able to do, but if you want a more flexible connection or like a more flexible option and a more understandable connection, what I would suggest that you use is Shopify over here. Now, Shopify is has been around in a long time. Uh, it came first, I think, came first than TikTok Shop. So people used Shopify before more than TikTok Shop, but nowadays people are shifting to TikTok Shop. Because in Shopify, you're able to integrate and connect multiple platforms all at once. And uh, one of those apps, as you can see, we also have apps over here in Shopify. If you click on Add Apps, you will be able to view a pop-up, which will show us all the different apps available in Shopify. So what these apps are for is to improve our experience with Shopify itself. We could either add some features or have some connection between different platforms. And one of those is Amazon. So over here, simply click on Shopify App Store, which will expound or expand the list of apps that we will be able to view, as you can see. And so what we're first going to search is TikTok. Shop, there we go. So we could use Shopify as the middleman where we will be able to connect TikTok Shop and Amazon together and manage it through Tik to Shopify. So we have this app over here called Quick Sync for TikTok Shop. So what this option allows over here is it allows us to sync our inventory, our name, our prices, our description, all of those things. So aside from the fact that you will now be able to use or have Amazon over here as a source of product, you could also now connect it to other platforms as well, not just limited to Amazon, but through our Shopify store over here, you are able to do it as well. So you could easily install this. Uh, there is, uh, this is currently a paid from $19 a month, but there is a trial version that you will be able to get. You will be able to install. So basically over here. And while waiting for this to install, uh, we're going to search in the app store over here, Amazon. Here we go. We have Amazon drop shipping option over here. And over here, we have options such as lit commerce, said commerce. Uh, there's different types of platforms over here. Uh, we could add the specific name drop shipping over here to help us narrow down our different apps, as you can see. So we could check out Amazon Integration Plus or this one, Amazon Importer. Over here, uh, this is currently QuickSync. Are you going to have to choose over here? You will be able to access the free 14-day trial, but you're going to have to input your payment information. But anyway, you will be able to basically sync uh, different products into your store. So I'm going to go to Shopify over here. And so over here, we have our product importer. So we could click on install over here. So what this app will do for us is that it will be able to import products from Amazon into our Shopify store. And if we or if you successfully got the quick sync feature in TikTok, the TikTok app that we showed you earlier. And when you're successfully able to connect it with your TikTok shop, what it would do is that any product listed in your Shopify store will automatically be transferred inside of TikTok over here. So you will be able to receive the product into your TikTok shop from our Shopify over here. So 
uh, let's open Canva over here to explain it once again so that we have a better understanding on how it works. So we will be basically using Shopify as our middleman for all of our uh, tasking over here. But anyway, we have this. Uh, let's install this so that we can check out how it works. We also have this one, Amazon Integration Plus, that you could use. It's basically similar where you will be able to manage your Amazon things inside of Shopify. Anyway, so let me explain it. So basically, we have Amazon over here. And we have our TikTok shop. And we have our Shopify. So right now, what we want is to dropship Amazon products into TikTok shop. So we want to establish a connection or get products from Amazon to TikTok shop. Now with the method that I'm explaining right now, we will go through Shopify. So if you were able to get the application to connect with Shopify and TikTok, any product listed in Shopify will automatically be added to TikTok. And now with the application that the Amazon request over here, what you will be able to do is you will be able to get any product in Amazon. For example, this one. Open a random one for now. Copy the link. Paste it over here. And then we will be able to space, supposedly uh, be able to import this. Add product. The we go. You can see importing is in progress. Once we were able to successfully import it, it will then be recognized inside of Shopify's product list so we got product from amazon through shopify through our link and then it will recognize that that product now exists in shopify's product listing which will then transfer it automatically to tiktok so i can't show you guys this part over here because the other version or the quick sync was paid and even though there's a free trial i don't really have a payment method that i could register for it to be accepted but as you can see we were able to successfully import our product over here so it should be able to recognize it over here if it's not available here it would take a bit uh, for it to recognize but anyway there we go as you can see uh, the product is inside of our product store and we will or supposedly be able to import it inside of our tiktok shop if and when you have the other application discussed earlier now sometimes the different applications that we're discussing the different apps available in TikTok shop or in Shopify are not available in certain areas or certain countries. So uh, I would still be able to allow us or there's still a method that would still allow us to be able to establish a connection between our Amazon and TikTok which is a very manual method. So what you're going to do is you're going to open your Amazon over here, look for the product that you want to sell and basically you're going to copy every information. You're going to copy the title you're going to copy the price, you're going to copy the description, you're going to copy the images, all of those things. You could scrap it or scrape it and get all the necessary data from this platform. You could even copy the URL link over here. And basically, you're going to go to TikTok shop, click on manage product or add new product over here. And we're going to basically upload our image that we have gotten from Amazon. You're going to have to do this manually, so you might need or you might want to get some extension like Amazon Image Downloader. Extension, something like this. And you will be able to find different apps from uh, the Chrome Web Store, for example, this one. So basically, you will be able to download images that you have found in Amazon. And what you're going to do is you're going to upload them manually into our tiktok shop over here then you're going to put in the brand name of course so we can copy this put it over here and then you can select categories you have your product details simply input the product details that you need also there's ai generated product description available over here so if you want to help spice up or help improve the description of your product because maybe you're not satisfied with the description it's about it's a bit too a short something like that if you're not satisfied you could ask ai for help and you could also submit some videos 
and many many other uh, sections as well so for example let's select our section over here uh, you could put in the price over here so what you're going to do is you're going to convert uh, our price over here so this one is 15 uh, 29 dollars over here so we're going to convert that to whatever your price uh is in your location and of course you're going to add a little bit to that because you want to earn something if you don't add something to this you won't be able to earn of course so it's like what's the point if you're going to earn the same amount you're going to spend so you're just going to add a tiny bit amount and after that you're going to simply click on submit for review and TikTok shop will review the product that you have added. It's not that hard uh, unless you are trying to add an illegal product or product that does not uh, comply with TikTok shop's rules and regulations. So that is something you need to manage as well. So what I would suggest if you're going to do that method, this manual method, is that you would get um, a sheet or like an Excel sheet that you could do. So we could open some Excel over here. There we go, sheets. And having a sheet would help manage your different information. And with the manual method, you would need to you would need to have some good great uh, management of information. So over here, for example, we could copy our title. There we go. Let's turn this into normal text over here eight here we go and then we could have the pricing maybe fifteen dollars stuff like that and then you could have here the url link so that you will be able to find where to order it or where to find the product and then all of those other necessary information it depends on how you would like to manage your data now the question is what happens when someone orders our product that we have gotten from amazon when we did the manual method it's not like we have an established connection like Shopify or TikTok shop in itself that would automatically manage those things for us. What you would do is basically when someone orders from you in TikTok shop, you will be able to get their information, their info, your customer info. So what you would then do is you're going to go to the Amazon page or the specific page that the product has been ordered. That's why I said uh, to get the link over here, put it there. And what you're going to do is you're going to enter or buy that product yourself in Amazon over here. You're going to click on buy now, add the cart, and you're going to in enter the information of the customer. So even though you are the one who ordered that product, you're the one who got the product uh, from Amazon, Amazon will not deliver it to you. It will be delivered through or to the information you have inputted. So. It doesn't matter if I live in the US, if the customer's information came from, let's say, uh, Europe, Amazon will, or the Amazon store will deliver that product to Europe because that's the information I have given them. That's the information I have provided and it will not send it to me. And the payment method will also depend on how or when the customer pays or how the customer pays. So it depends on your strategy. It's going to be harder with the manual method, of course, since, of course, it's manual. That's why I said in the beginning of the video, uh, it's a more hassle one. But if the different processes or the different methods that was mentioned earlier suits your interest, it's less hassle. You could do that those as well. Although the disadvantage is most of them, most of the products or the applications are going to be paid. Even the one in TikTok shop, uh, there are apps there that need to be paid. So that's something you have to check out as well. So aside from that, uh, I'm sure there are other uh, platforms, other third-party platforms that you could utilize that I have not mentioned in today's video. And I think you will be able to uh, look into those in the future as well. As, uh, as more platforms develop, as more apps develop, as more connection that would allow us to connect Amazon and TikTok shop to develop exists in the future. You will be able to have a better a dropshipping experience between TikTok shop and Amazon. So uh, you are also not limited to Amazon with the methods that I have mentioned. Although we specifically focus on Amazon, uh, there are different ways for you to modify a tiny bit of our process and 
maybe use eBay or Etsy or AliExpress or CG Dropshipping, those other platforms, you are able to use those platforms as well uh, if you prefer to use them. So that's basically it guys. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.